of Nyayo Estate and Mbakasi have protested what they claim is a plan by private developers to grab a piece of land set aside for public utility. Residents who held protests around the estate on Saturday clashed with a group of men who were protecting the land in dispute, despite the fact that the matter is before the Environment and Lands Court. Nyayo Estate residents say despite a court order sp uh, stopping activities on the land, I beg your pardon, there are developers currently putting up structures on it. The National Social Security Fund, which developed Nyayo Estate, says it has taken steps to halt any activity on the land, stating that it is designated for public utility. The rather quiet Nyayo Estate in Embakasi was turned into a protest ground. <laughs> Residents coming out in numbers to oppose what they claim is an attempt by private developers to grab a piece of land set aside for construction of a community public school. <laughs> Their march to the site ended unceremoniously after unknown persons took charge of the land and ordered them to keep off. <laughs> for over an hour, the two groups engaged in a shouting march with residents demanding access to the site, which the other team was protecting. What we are saying and we are calling upon the authorities to safeguard this property, this land 817, belongs to the residents. And now you can see there are activities going on there. You can see there are about 40, 50 people who have been brought in to gather place. We do not know what is under construction, but for sure it is not a school and for sure it is not the developer or a public uh, office developing that space. So that's a private developer. Residents say it all began after a section of the wall around the six-acre piece of land was demolished a few years back. Encroachers accessed the area and the residents' association took the matter to court. An order issued by the Environment and Land Court in July put a stop to alienation of the land, either by construction, subdivision, transfer or sell, until the case is heard and determined. Despite there being a court order, and even we have a letter from NSSF copy to the OCS of Embakasi that no activity should be going on here, you find that people still going on with construction. And like we said, any time there's construction, there has to be public participation. We have to know what is being constructed. There has to be a board and so on. A statement from NSSF, the property owners of Nyayo Estate to the residents on Friday, stated that they had removed individuals who had encroached on the property and that the matter has been reported to authorities. Gatete Njoroge, Citizen TV, Nairobi.